Hi guys, it is us again. Oh. We this is my show. I'm Beyonce, you are Michelle, okay? It's not your turn. Michelle said people shine too. Kelly said that. Oh. And mm, yeah. Michelle knows when to play her part, and it's not your part right now. It's it's my part because I'm Beyonce. Anyway, we are on our way to another Chase and the Crawfords adventure. And this is going to be, it's going to be epic too, like Jamaica. Because this is going to be a multi-destination trip. This is going to be the longest trip that we have ever taken together. We're going to be gone for eight days, y'all. Eight days. Without the cheering just the two well most of those eight days are going to be just the two of us on the back end we're going to another trip where we'll be with some more people so we may not end up vlogging that because i just want to protect everybody's privacy but the first person portion of the trip will just be the two of us and we're going to bring you guys along All right, guys, this is our first stop. Bucky's going to get some snacks. That is what I came for. Hi guys, we are in our hotel. We did not come back and wrap up the vlog last night, but this is how close we are to the port. You can see the ships right there. Our ship is right there, the Carnival Freedom. We will be getting on it shortly. So we're just wrapping up in the room and getting ready to go over to the port. Hi guys, we are waiting to board the ship. We are in the captain's lounge right now because we are staying in a suite. So we have priority boarding and all of that jazz. And it's really nice in here, but yeah. I just wanted to come in and check in with you guys. guys we have made it to our room we are staying in a suite so we got priority boarding this is what the room looks like so this is our closet oh well i can't get that side open closet bathroom and we have a decent sized shower double sinks Hi guys, we have gotten in settled into our room yeah. and now we're about to go up to the Lido deck and get us a guy's burger and a drink. I'll take you guys with us. Hey guys, Didi's just going to get her something to eat. I'm waiting, holding down the fort until she gets back. I think I'm gonna give you some guys. I don't know exactly what she's getting, but we shall see. Hey guys, got some guys, burger surprise. Got a double cheese burger with some chili and some onions. Well, 
Well, guys, as you can see, we had a good time. Um, a couple of drinks down, a couple of burgers down. Didi's actually going to get get us some of the blue blue iguana uh, tacos. I'm getting a pork, and I'm pretty sure she's getting chicken. So we'll see how those taste, and we'll get back to you guys. So we're gonna go to the main dining room and fix our um, dining reservations. Then I'm going to bed until four o'clock when it's time for the celebrate party. Cause baby, I'm done. guys so what we are about to do is make an in cabin sangria so the first thing you're going to do is go to the buffet and get you some fruit i got an orange here i got a pear here this pear is for a different sangria so we're not going to cut that up right now get you some silverware from the buffet it might not be tough enough to cut through your fruit but when i was in the military they taught me to improvise adapt and overcome so what you're gonna do is exactly those things. You're gonna figure out how to cut through this orange. Y'all already washed this orange. So you didn't see it, but I did it. You're gonna cut your fruit up. Also, when you're at the buffet, try to find some fruit that's already cut up. I got some pineapples over there that I'm gonna use that's already cut up. The oranges were whole, so we gotta make do with what we got, okay? All right, so we got our oranges cut up. All right, guys, so I got my handy dandy drink dispenser from the Dollar Tree. So what we're gonna do is throw our fruit in here. I got some oranges. I got some, now bring you some Ziploc bags on the ship with you. Go to the buffet, get you some fruit, put your fruit in a Ziploc bag. I got some pineapple and one piece of rogue watermelon. I don't even like watermelon. I don't know why I got it, but just trust the process. Now, I got some Earl Stevens Tropiscato. If y'all don't know who Earl Stevens is, it's E40. So anyway, we're gonna pour this in here. I brought me some pineapple juice on board. If you don't know, you can bring 12 cans of canned beverage per person on board. So I got me some pineapple juice from Trader Joe's. Oh Lord, I can't get it open, hold on. You gonna pour that in there. Now normally with sangria, you add a, a liquor to the wine and the fruit. This wine is 18% alcohol. I don't know if you can see that. So I feel like it doesn't need any additional liquor. So we're not putting nothing else in there. Okay, we're just gonna do this. And then we're gonna stir it up. All right, so we're gonna stir this up. our lid back on and now you have your handy dandy sangria in your cabin so this is going to save you some money while you're on the ship because you're not going to have to be running back and forth to the bar come back for more tips two hours later all right guys we have already sailed away from port canaveral i was in the bed so i missed the sail away party so i'm just sitting out on my balcony right now 
getting some silhouette waves. And it's almost time for me to get ready for dinner at six o'clock. All right, bye. Hi guys, we are dressed and ready to go to our dinner at the steakhouse. So come along with us. All right guys, we're at Sun King Steakhouse. My wife provided me with a steakhouse dinner, surprise dinner. I appreciate it. We have the breadsticks and this is called sea salt bread. Uh, never tried that before. We'll try that. We have the regular butter over here and then we have butter inside with some spinach, spinach almonds, almonds and different things on the, on the outside of it excited to try that we'll bring you our first appetizers and everything else in a few all right guys we have our crab pad in front of the ship All right, guys, we just finished eating at the steakhouse and we are heading to the Alcavin bar. Didi wants some martinis. So where we're going, we'll be on deck three, deck five. So we had to walk all the way down to aft and then we can go down. All right, guys, we did make it to the Alchemy Bar. It's pretty chill. Um, we're just sitting here, got us a couple of drinks, and just going to enjoy some time alone with each other. Uh, we'll get back to you if we do anything else, okay? See you. All right, guys, we have done all the things and had all the drinks. So we went and got some pizza. We got our dessert to go from the steakhouse. So this is my cheesecake something. I don't know, cheesecake with hazelnut crust or something. I don't know. So that's what I'm about to eat because I just ate two slices of pizza. And I'm about to watch um harlem over again on my ipad because i downloaded all the episodes if you have not watched harlem on prime video it is fantastic with megan good all right that's all goodbye